Hey guys, welcome to the 2 a.m. pipe on the patio with Onion. Coming to you from the Onion Patch. Little housekeeping. I am smoking my uh, Boot Show Cam Tricord. This was the first pipe I ever got. Right here. 25, 26 years ago, 1994. And in it, I am smoking Victor Manil Simwa La Brumuse. Amazing stuff. This is truly amazing stuff. Anybody looking for any of the Simwa, it is available right now on SmokingPipes.com. I just ordered the other two. La Petite Robin and I forget what the other one's called. But I ordered the two I don't have so I can try those out. Uh, such a good blend. Um, I just wanted to, if anybody is smoking this stuff, I just want to remind you guys to pack this stuff tight. This has to be packed really tight because it's so dry. You got to pack it tight so that it'll burn slower, cooler. Otherwise it goes up like that. So the secret to smoking this stuff is to pack your bowl tight. And then sip it. This has such a wonderful flavor to it. If you go on YouTube, you can, um, in fact, I'll put the link down below. There are several videos of uh, Victor Manil. Uh, they're in French, but you can really get an idea of what, what he's doing with his tobacco and how he does each brick one at a time of his tobacco. He's got a little press that packs it, wraps it, and then he puts a label around it one brick at a time. He does it all himself. But I found it, even though it was in French when I watched it, I was fascinated with it because you could kind of, you know, understand what's going on. But And then when he starts talking about the tobaccos, it's just amazing to see how he does it at his house all by himself, just one brick at a time. Good stuff. They come in 3.5 ounce bricks. And you get a ton of tobacco. This is a single brick. And I've been smoking this for a month and a half, two months, three months now. And it's still almost full. But because it's so dry, you get so much tobacco in three and a half ounces. It's ridiculous how much tobacco you wind up with. I mean, I, I had to jam this thing. This is a, uh, I forget what size this one is. But it's, uh, Wide mouth, it's I think it's a six sixteen ounce jars. Fifteen ounce, I'm not sure. I had to jam it in here and that was a single brick of tobacco. It just when you open it up, start pouring it out, it just expands up. But because the way it's so dry, the weight, you get way more tobacco per ounce than you would a wet tobacco. 
you know. So it's a little, I mean, it's three and a half ounces. It was $27 and change on smokingpipes.com. So that's what, thirteen fifty an ounce basically. But you get so much tobacco for it. And this is the only tobacco I smoke that I will smoke two or three bowls in a roll out of this tobacco. Other tobaccos I rarely do that. Maybe only Black Irish Twist would be the only other one that I would do two bowls in a row. This La Brumuse is delicious, and I, I've heard good things about the La Petite Robin. And I can't remember the name of the other one. There's three different kinds that he does, but it's all done in the this one little valley in Belgium. He grows it all himself. Does the, the entire process is done by him from start to finish. Um, I mean, he may have helped planting it, I don't know, but as far as the processing part of it, which is very minimally processed, it's dried out, it's cut up, and then it's it's packaged. And God, it is just so good. I really enjoy this stuff. And this tobacco is only grown in that region of Belgium. That little, that one valley in there. God, it is so good. Anyway, I just wanted to share this one with you. I was watching uh, There and Tobacco. He did a review of this also today. We had a lot of interesting information about the area and stuff like that. So I, I will put a link to his video down below. So go check his video out. It's uh, well worth watching. I will catch you guys later. The sun is coming out here and it is blasting down on me. So I will talk to you all later. Have a good one.